Naps is uh, is an exceptionally talented rugby player, um, and I'd still say he's in a development phase. I, I don't think we've we've scratched the surface of what he is actually capable of doing, and I say that in sevens and fifteens. Um, there's not many players that have the strength and the power that he has. A bit like Sorelli, a bit like Juta, um, that explosive power, um, ball handling skills, kicks off both feet, um, has won us games on his own at times. And this is only a kid that's been sort of with us since sort of 2018, 19, and came on to the scene when we won the series and had that man of the match final against New Zealand in Paris. And I think that, you know, to take him from where he has been to where he is now, I think he's had an exceptional rise. I would love to see that rise continue, uh, whether that's sevens or fifteens for him. Um, I do believe that uh, physically he, he, he does need to have potentially have an operation um, because I think that there is an impingement in his knee that he needs to have uh, seen to. And I think that will free up his running and increase his conditioning levels. Um, and I also think that he needs the care of good coaches to allow him to be able to express himself, but also have the opportunity to make mistakes and learn from that as well. And I think that sometimes we're very quick to judge players on things we see on social media um, and, and things that we think that, that, that they can be better at. But sometimes we're not quick enough to to rejoice in what they can actually give us as well. And I thought that over the three days, the combination of Balada and Nathungu kept opposition guessing the whole time. Just when you think you've got Balada sorted, then all of a sudden Nathungu comes on the field and just elevates us to another level as well. And and I think that the pair of those have been instrumental for where we find ourselves today, but certainly in the qualities we've had and the way that they are about the group as well. I mean, Naps is, he is a leader. He, he's, he, he's cheeky. Um, he is funny. Uh, he's vibrant. He's energetic. Um, and he's a joy to be around when he's like that, but he can be a right pain in the bum when he's not like that. And, and one of the biggest things in being a professional player is learning the consistency and learning how that can energize or de-energize others around you and and you know that's been a big work on of his continues to work on it but what i do know is that when he's at it and when he's he's focused on his work he's one of the certainly one of the best sevens players in the world and i'd love to see him do that in 15s as well